This spirited man does not know what to do exactly. Doesn't exactly know what this episode is about. But he does know that he needs to make a ping pong ball hopper lotto number selection machine. So that is what he's doing. He'll start there. This indecision stalemate is caused, so he thinks, by too much ambition, too many ideas. Where do we start? Where are we going? Why are we going there? Is our plan too selfish, or does it serve? What the hell is the plan? What the hell is this episode about? It's about how to get unstuck. This happens all the time. What does he want to do with this channel, with his life? Too much? Not enough? He wants to fix the Land Cruiser. It's too loud. It bothers the whole neighborhood, the whole town. Sounds like a lawnmower. A thousand bucks to quiet it down for a month or two until he can swap the engine for a new one in Montana. That's where they swap the engine in Montana. The engine swapping shop is in Montana and they're all booked up for the next month or two. Gotta wait in line. With the new engine, he'll be able to drive the family down to Oaxaca, God willing. Then maybe Panama. Imagine. Thank God for this channel, for the support. He can afford to fix the Land Cruiser, then swap the engine, thanks to this channel. Keep the channel going. Gotta keep the channel going. But with what? What the hell is this episode about? It's about how to get unstuck. This happens all the time. Too many ideas. Where to begin, what to do. What to do right now. Organize. There's too much junk in the basement. He swore off renting storage spaces after moving out of the Bronx studio in 2016. Told himself he wouldn't acquire the junk that would necessitate renting a storage space. He was right then. No more junk. And he's wrong now, renting another storage space. The $150 a month will be his trick me twice, shame on me tax. A junk tax. Of course, he's the one who tricked him twice. Tricked himself twice. But organize. It's part of the ritual of getting yourself unstuck. Organize. When you don't know what to do next, organize. Get yourself some space. The Lotto Ping Pong Machine will go right there. Why are we stuck? Why is he stuck this time? Too many ambitions. Not enough plans. Make the plans. That's what we do next. But we gotta make the episodes, too. Gotta make the money. Gonna need money to execute the plans. Best not make the plans and ambitions too selfish now. Get yourself some good plans. They'll support you, they'll support you. Everybody will help you discover what you set out to find, said the man with the Nobel Prize. just needs to mean enough to do it. Want to get the Land Cruiser fix, want to get the new engine, want to start some kind of school, want to start a fixin' club, promote it in the paper, want to rent one of these buildings, ain't sure exactly why. Want to drive the family to Mexico, want to drive the family to Panama, get some things fixed and go on adventures basically. Meet some people, 
see more people, and the ideas, God willing, are going to get us there. But we got to commit to them by doing them. Can't just think about them, no. And we got to make the decision about what to do next. That's the first thing we got to do when we got to do something. And we definitely got to do something. Terrence Malick, one of the heroes of cinema, made a movie called To the Wonder, a masterpiece. All of Malick's movies are masterpieces. There's a scene that he remembers so clearly, a priest talking about indecision. The priest says, we wish to live inside the safety of the laws. We fear to choose. Jesus insists on choice. One thing he condemns utterly is avoiding the choice. To choose is to commit yourself, and to commit yourself is to run the risk of failure, the risk of sin, the risk of betrayal. But Jesus can deal with all of those. Forgiveness, he never denies us. The man who makes a mistake can repent, but the man who hesitates, who does nothing, who buries his talent in the earth, with him, he can do nothing. And so the choices will go into this hopper, and the universe, and the universe, aided by this leaf blower, will decide which choices come when. Next time we're stuck, we're going to let Mr. Steel here decide which choice we make. And we'll just get on with it.